So website localization involves translation, of course, which is to, to, to create or to render the words in other languages. But it's also involving the graphics, the images, to uh, do new layouts, to uh, change the engineering code if necessary for Asian languages, for example, to do the testing to make sure all the links work right, and of course internationalization, which is a critical process. And that involves, um, for example, looking at the currency, the dates, the time issues, um, pictures, images, whether they work properly, and certain expressions that are used in English that don't necessarily convert into the other language. The other part of the localization process that we can offer is to convert the domain name itself into other languages and then to get the domain name registered in that language and in the target country. And that, of course, enables users in that country to be able to search within their language and find the American firm in their country and therefore get the American company more business. For clients that are looking to localize their website in any of the 80 languages we do, there are three different pricing options that we can offer. One is to do the full website itself. One is to do an abridged website, such as the home page, the contact page, and key product pages. And one is to do a two or three page summary of the company, which we can prepare in a doc or a PDF format in any of the 80 languages that we provide.